Hello everyone, my name is Om Sagasong. Today I want to make a quick video about how to run apps in Android Studio on your real Android device. Sometimes you know you want to test your Android app not from your emulator because the behavior is different so you want to test it with your real device. So you can do that but you have to config something. So first make sure you connect your Android phone uh, to your computer with your USB port and usually you buy your phone you have the USB cable and connect to that computer and then you have to go to setting you can find setting somewhere web up I see the setting uh, icon and scroll up you will see the about phone and there is a trick there because you cannot see the developer option you have to go to uh, build number so here build number in the software information and you have to click on the build number seven times okay and after that you will see the developer uh, you know option uh, you go back one more time and scroll down you will see developer options okay and you have to turn on the debug mode the USB debugging mode to on if it is off like that you have to turn it on click ok so after that you can run your app from your Android studio on your real device okay and now you can test your real camera your real voice whatever okay but I want to show you one cool app called Sizing by Samsung now you can mirror your screen on your real Android device and display it in your PC but you need to install it on both computer and Android device of course it is free it's provided by Samsung okay now it's done okay now you can open it and it needs some permission so just click allow and just uh, you know the default uh, permission that you have to provide and down here you will see the start button click on start now you are ready to do with uh, your computer okay so on your computer you have to install the app too okay let me go back to the computer screen okay now I'm in the computer screen and open the browser and type Samsung site thing okay it's very easy and the first one and now you can download it if you are Mac download from Mac now I download it for PC okay so now it's done so just click it to install just hit next and you know just a usual app nothing special no uh, serial code no anything okay and now it's finished just run it okay let me turn off the screen record okay so now it needs to pair from your computer uh, to your Android phone make sure you connect it with the USB device okay hit next now I have to click OK from my phone and click OK uh, from my computer too and one more time okay looks good there you go now you can see the uh, real device on your computer so it's very to, to test because the performance here is the uh, phone performance is not the emulator but you can see it you don't have to go back to your screen on your small device and you know turn back and forth from your computer to your phone uh, it's very annoying okay let me show you if I turn on the camera from the app here see this is the real uh, camera from my phone so it is real okay okay take the screenshot just like in your normal phone and lastly I want to show you if you want to test uh, your Android app so just like a normal one 
and when you hit run you will see uh, the real device on the top there okay just click that and click ok just like the note 1 and now you will see the app is running on your phone not uh, on your emulator the speed is the real speed and you can always switch back and forth okay and that's it for this video i hope you like it if you have any question just ask me in the comment section down below hit the like button if you like it and please don't forget to subscribe to this channel thank you and i will see you in the next video